start to begin. Hello everyone, and welcome to my new playthrough. It's going to be of Crash Bandicoot 3. Well, Crash Bandicoot Warped, as they call it. <coughs> um, well, I say to all the pe no, zero people who are watching, like my other Crash Bandicoot playthroughs. So this leads on from the, the end of Crash 2, obviously. Let's just watch it. <coughs> Uka, Uka is free. No, it cannot be. Evil, great evil has come. None dare to fail to bring Uka, Uka even once. But you, Cortex, you have failed me twice. Great Uka, Uka, it was that infernal. Bandicoot! From deep inside my temple prison, I sent you simple instructions to follow. But you lost the gems, you lost the crystals, and I have lost my patience! There is now no other power source left on this planet. I know we've had a few unfortunate setbacks and failed but since your bumbling has managed to set me free i am feeling generous there is still a way for us to amass the power needed to enslave this miserable planet and this time this time the great uka uka will make sure that you do it right after many eons my evil twin, Uka Uka, has been freed from his underground prison. Long ago, I locked him there to protect the world from his malice. Now, free once again, he must be stopped. <laughs> Children. Uka Uka and Cortex plan to use this time-twisting machine to gather crystals that lay scattered across time. I have brought you here to recover the crystals before they do so. To open the time portal, simply stand on a button and then jump into the portal. Good luck. Okay, so basic premise of this one, um, I've put 105% playthrough in the title. Now admittedly, any time I've done a Crash crash 1 playthrough, cra Crash 3 playthrough, I've never actually got all the Platinum Relics. So this would be a new thing. But I'm going to give it a go. Crash, if I get Crash, oh, Crash, why must you always muck in my mud? Oh look, I have a mask helping me too. We will find out which one is more powerful soon enough. Yeah, so um, it'll be an interesting experience for me. Um, I'm going to attempt to get all the Platinums, but if I get sick of it, I may just ditch it and just go for the like secret ending, you know, 100% plus playthrough. Oops. Good start. Oh, as you see, that they've made the whole these crates go quicker, which is, you know, always welcome. So I'm just going to start, I'll do this level, um, just tonight, because I'm touch tired. Just get this one out of the way. As for, um, the relics, uh, I'm gonna hold off, like, I won't get the relics in these sorts of levels where Crash is just platforming normally until after I've beaten the game, because then obviously I'll get the running shoes. Um, I'm pretty sure that the running shoes are probably required for platinum in these sort of levels, but then there'll be the um, other levels, like the speedboat levels. Um, 
uh, tiger levels, um, jet ski levels, you know, that's where, um, I'll be able to get the relic because running shoes won't factor, so I'll just move and get the relics. That's another thing I like about Crush Free, um, it tells you how many boxes there are, you know, uh, how many in the bonus. Better to keep track of them. This one will be pretty straightforward. Is the first level after all? Ugh. changing to the end. Yeah. Ah, nice straightforward one. from the second game obviously okay so that was the first level I've even forgotten what it's called what was it called Toad Village all right so f that's the first village first level Toad Village thank you for watching I'll see you in the next one thanks for watching <laughs>